Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasuke channel. Today we are going to use uh, part designs in Katia version 5. Okay, open your Katia software. You can double click on icons. You can click star. Choose uh, mechanical designs and click part designs. So it will be go into drawing area on a part designs. If you want to flow out uh, this toolbar you only click at this point and move into here and you want to put in a toolbar you only click again and move it to this point and if you want to add uh, some uh, toolbar in uh, this drawing area you can right click in here and choose toolbar that you want to active on a drawing area to change a unit you can click tools and you can go to options Click on parameters and measures and click unit tabs. Uh, in here you can click a length and you can set length in here. Units at series. For uh, this tutorial, I will use a uh, default uh, units in millimeters. You can click OK. Now we start to drawings. You can click this uh, X shape lines. Okay, you can see in here. For uh, part one, X shape lines. We also can create in uh, EZ, this is for front view and uh, this for left view. Okay, we can use uh, XJ plans. You can click uh, this icon to create sketch. The next, uh, I will use a uh, circle command in here. You can click circle. Okay, you can click stop on this point and move into here. We create again circle, stop on this point in a uh, vertical, move into here. And you can use uh, this uh, commands, uh, constraints to change uh, dimension in uh, this uh, circle object. You can click and we can change diameter into 160. Click OK. I will uh, use a uh, constraint again and we can click start from center points into this points. Move to drag here. We can set into 27. You can click OK. Now I will select uh, these objects and we can use rotate tools. You can click uh, this uh, drop down menu and choose uh, rotate. Okay, for uh, instance, I will set into three. It will be copy or duplicate uh, these uh, circles. And for uh, center point, we can click at these points. The next for value, we can set into 90 degree. So to be quite a trick copy of uh, the circles, you can click OK again. You can click offset to deselect. The next to zoom in, you can click this icon, zoom in. And now I will select uh, this uh, circle object and you can press delete button to erase. We can use the trim tools. You can click here trim, select at uh, this uh, circles inside and you can click at uh, the circles. So it will be connect and will be cut. We create again uh, with uh, trim command. Click uh, these uh, circles and click again at this point. The next uh, we use uh, the same steps like for uh, these uh, circle objects and click at these points. And the last from this point into this point. So we create uh, this uh, simple to this sketch. You can select uh, these all objects and I will make fix. You can use uh, these options, constraints, defines, and active for fix. You can click OK, so it will be fixed. I will use uh, fillet tools. You can click uh, this icon corner. Okay, we can click from this points into here, and we can set in here for radius into four. We can press enter. Use uh, fillet again from this points into here. We can set into four. The next corner we fillet at this point. Set into four, and the last. We fill it in uh, this point with four four radius. To close uh, this cat, you can click this icon. And now I will use uh, pet tools to convert this cat into three models. You can click uh, this icon pet. And for uh, length, we can set into ten millimeters. You can click preview. So this is for preview, and you can click OK to apply. We can select at this face and now we create again a uh, new sketch. You can click at this icon sketch. I will create circle. 
okay start from center point in here and we can set for radius you can use uh, this constraint tools for diameter i will set into 30 you can press enter to apply close again close get and now i will use pet tools we can extrude with length about 12 and you can click ok i will use orbit tools you can click uh, this icon so rotate so it will be rooted for a drawing area you can click hold and rotate to this point in here i will use shield tools you can click here shield select at uh, this face you can seal about uh, two millimeters and you can click ok so it will be seals into two millimeters you can see you can back again into this uh, isometric view. okay now in here i will select at this face and we create a new sketch again i will create circle okay, start from this point and we can set for diameter into eight press enter okay and you can select at this cube press control button to select multiple with the circle click at this command constraint define in dialog box and you can choose tangency click ok so it will be moved into this corner about the circles okay the next we create circle again start from this points and i will set for radius or diameter into eight we create again circle start from this point and you can set for diameter into 30 okay you can use a uh, line tools with a tangent you can click drop down menu and click these tools tangent line select up these circles and move into these circles we use again click the circles and click again the circle I will use trim tools you can click here trims and select at uh, these objects you can connect into this point we use a uh, trim again select uh, these objects and connect into here okay I will create circle in uh, this uh, center points with uh, diameter about full press enter you can select uh, these circle objects and press delete button the next i will use trim tools we can trim from this point and you can connect into here we trim again from this point we connect into this point okay now you can close cat and make sure you select uh, this uh, sketch we can use pet tools to extrude and i will set for length into five you can click ok the next we can use uh, circular patterns you can click a drop down menu in here and choose uh, this uh, circular pattern make sure you select uh, these objects and for instance in here i will set into four we can set parameter into complete crown and for uh, reference elements we can select at uh, this face so to be copy into four points in a polar system you can click preview and you can click OK to apply. The next, uh, I will use uh, fillet tools. You can click here, fillet or add fillet. For radius, I will set into one. Okay, for selection, we can select at this uh, point, also in here. Okay, you can set like at uh, the top view. The next, in uh, this edge. Okay, also in here in this edge in this point and the last at this point you can click preview so this is for preview and you can click ok to apply i will uh, use uh, orbit tools you can use uh, this rotate we rotate uh, this uh, driving area and i will select at this face the next you can create sketch Okay, in here I will create circle, start from this point. And we can set for geometer into 6. Press enter. Now you can select at this cube and also at this uh, circles. 
we use a tendency to connect you can click ok now i will create circle again in this point center point you can set for geometer into full click ok the next uh, you can close cats and we can use pet tools to extrude with the length in here set into six sorry we can set into eight okay this for x you can click preview it's for preview and you can click ok now in here we select the last uh, pet objects this objects and now you can use a circular pattern you can set into four and change four parameter into complete crown selection we can select at this face so it'll be copy into four you can click preview and you can click ok to apply so we create uh, these points you can go back into isometric view okay i will select at this face and we can create a polygon so you can create sketch choose uh, this drop down menu and use uh, this hexagon tools select from center point in here and move to the right here we can set for this time from this point into here i will set in here into 18 you can click ok now we can close cat and extrude these are objects you can set into 10 millimeters okay click again at the top view you can create cat now i will create circle start from these points move into here and you can set for diameter in here i will set into 12 sorry 15 okay now we can close and we can extrude about 10 millimeters and you can click ok the last we create holes from this uh, face you can click sketch and in here i will create circle from center point moving to here and we can set for geometer into 9 press enter sorry in here we can set into 9 press enter okay and you can close sketch we can use uh, these tools packet and it will be move to the bottom we can set for dips into 50 per view and you can click ok so it will be quite tall in uh, these models you can see okay the next how to change into for per view you can use uh, these uh, tools quite a multiple view so it will be quite a for view and see this uh, for isometric view you can uh, zoom out this is for uh, front view and if you want to change into back view you can click uh, these tools and click here so this is uh, for bottom view and now this is uh, for top view okay enough today for uh, basic modeling part the things in uh, katia version 5 if you have any question about this uh, tutorials you can comment below this video